Welcome back if you are watching on the video. Here we are, we're up to our third paragraph. Oh, what's the matter with this number? Who can tell me what the matter is with, with this number here? It's two. What, what should it be? Three. It's three. But for those of you who have got a few brains in there, it is sort of the second paragraph. It is the second paragraph of the... Body. Of the body. Nice work. Okay, so we're up to, I think, what, what is a fairly challenging... Fairly challenging... Maybe it's not. We'll see. We're up to the E. What does the E stand for, Ethan, Mom? Explain the point. Nice work. Explain the point. You're getting on board now. Well done. You've really come along since our last interaction. Okay, so we're going to explain this point. Secondly, we've got loads of other stuff to do at home. Can you explain it for me? Just unpack that a little bit. Or, secondly, homework lets us practice to get better at our learning. At our learning. Set it in. Okay. Uh, can someone explain this for me? Just unpack it a little. You know, take some more time to explain it. Second, we've got loads of other stuff to do at home. What sort of stuff might you have to do at home? This is the time for that stuff. Yeah? Yeah, at home we might want to run around the lake. Okay. okay. Um, you might want to write we're off, for example. Like how we can write, for example, I'd rather say that. Uh, I think I'll say it, for example. Right? At home, instead of doing homework, we might want to run around the lake. We, well, we, we might want to go for a run. Let's just write that. We might want to go for a run. We might want to go for a run. Go for a run. Or something else, or play, what else, instead of doing homework, or play Sleep. football. Thank you. Right, there you go, easy. At home, instead of doing homework, we might want to go for a run or play football. Okay, that explains that first bit, doesn't it? The next bit, so you can start thinking, for example, and you're going to give some actual evidence. So start thinking. You know, something you can make up the evidence, by the way. <clears throat> I'm alright with you making it up. Okay. Um, what about over here, guys? Not Liam again. Liam's doing both. Liam's writing both. Homework should be banned and homework shouldn't be banned. Which one are you writing? Um, shouldn't. Shouldn't. Okay, well, give me, give me one for this, then I'm fine. Um, yeah, how do you explain it? Secondly, homework lets us practice to get better at our learning. You need to practice so um, in, later in life, um, if you like, come across that um, problem, you can know what to do. Okay, so uh, you, you need to practice things uh, so that later on in life uh, you, you'll be more uh, capable at them. Is that okay? Yep. Okay? Good. You need to practice things. So later in life, you know, I'm going to keep what you said. You will be better at them. I'm going to keep your language exactly. You will be better at them. Great. And here you go. For example, comma. So we're going to give some actual evidence. So start thinking about some evidence there. Right? For example. I think this is the tricky bit. You've sort of got to come up with a real life situation that fits your argument. Okay? Remember, it doesn't have to be absolutely true. Uh, not for this purpose. Okay? I won't be checking that it's true. I'll be checking that it makes sense. Okay? Uh, back to here. Homework should be banned. Watch it for example. At home, instead of doing homework, we might want to go for run or play football. So. What's our for example thing? An actual example that we had. That a real life one. Ethan? Yeah, the way you play football. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
I'm going to keep half of that. For example, yesterday I wanted to play soccer, but finish it off for me. I had to do homework instead. Does that make sense? That's a real life thing. You know, you wanted to play soccer, but you had to do homework instead. And you can see how it links to this. We've got loads of other stuff to do at home, like soccer. So we shouldn't have homework. Does that make sense, guys? Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But I had to do... And you know what? I'm going to add a little detail there because it makes it even more real. I had to do <laughs> maths homework instead because it just makes it more specific. You know, the more specific you can, you can be, the better. Maths homework instead. Great. Like, there's real evidence. And try to spell instead correctly, Mr. Burns. T-E-A-D. Right. Give me a for example over here why it shouldn't be banned. Give me a for example why it shouldn't be banned. River? Um, um, and Okay. And they went, and they went badly. That's great. For example, last week in my class, class, comma, there was a test. And some people didn't do the homework set for it. Didn't do the homework set for it. They went, how'd they go, River? They went badly. Great. Like it. And if we had more room, we'd write those Sydney individuals or something like that. Good. That's good. Can we link it? This bit's easy. This bit's easy. I'm not going to tell you. One of you is going to tell me. The linking is going to be pretty similar to what we did last time. Maybe check your other one when you're done. I know you're busy writing. Maybe check your other one. How do we link it? We've got to link it to... Do we link it to the point? No? Sort of. We really link it to our per position. position, which is the big overall thing. Okay, so what do we say? Yes, Josh? There's another reason why we shouldn't have homework. Great, perfect. This, yeah, it's great, isn't it? Yep. Yeah. This is another reason why we should not have homework. Great. Great, great, great. Link the other one for me. Sort of the same, isn't it? But it's reversed. River's always telling me something. Someone who doesn't tell me something much. You are telling me plenty, Josh. You are telling me lots, River. So are you, Liam. Darren, not hearing much out of you. Are you doing this one? Okay, who's doing this one? Who's going to pick on? Who's doing homework shouldn't be banned? Angelo, great. Link it for me, Angelo. Um... Okay. Yep. You're making this too hard. Angela's making this too hard. We're not going back to the main idea or the main point. Angela, look at me. We're not going back to the main idea or the main point. We're going back to... Position. Read your position for me. Read it out loud. I firmly believe that homework should be So that's what you've sort of got to say here. This is why... Perfect. Perfect. Let's write it down. This is why homework shouldn't be banned. This is why homework shouldn't be banned. Great, Angelo. And you see, what we're doing, mate, is we're linking it to our 
overall position, you know, a big position in that first bit, not, not every little bit. Does that make sense? That's why I've got this little dot here, guys. Look at my little dot arrow that goes link the point to the position. Yeah, you just use that same language. Oh, how are we going? One more paragraph. One more paragraph of our body, body and then a conclusion. 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 So I sort of hope we do a persuasive text now in that plan. We're having such fun, fun time with it. Like I said, I've got a feeling we'll do narrative. I can feel it in my teacher bones, but we'll see. Have we written that down yet? We have. Well, what paragraph are we up to now? We're up to paragraph number three. Four. We're, up to, we're up to body three, aren't we? But overall, we're up to paragraph number four. four. Who keeps saying three? Count your paragraphs. Okay, if you are not up to paragraph number four, there is an issue. Good, I'm just going to stop this and start taping again.